they ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine. You just can't get into it because they would never understand. Yes, the internet trolls are doing their best to try and get to us, but let's not let it happen. Please subscribe to the channel and follow my social links. What's happening, guys? It's B-Rad, and yes, it is true what the thumbnail and the description says. This is another pack opening slash pick opening for the Premier League team of the season. It is obviously one of the most sought after team of the seasons that we get. And for that reason, after opening packs, I thought, do you know what? I've got enough to do a decent amount of packs and picks again. And nothing else really at the moment excites me. Plus, I will probably be able to get even more packs again for this next, what is that, Bundesliga Tots, I believe, um, that's coming up. So why not do some more today? I have 50 player picks. Um, uh, three of those are the 85 pluses and I think over 50 packs to open. So, um, what I will do this time, usually on my Friday night pack openings, I go through all the player picks with you. Um, this time I will just show you like the walkouts and, and the cream of the crop. Okay. Um, if you do like the content on this channel, please do subscribe. It is a massive, massive help to the channel growing, uh, to me to help spur me on to create content and all that stuff. And it's free to do um likewise if you are enjoying the content smash a like drop a comment down what you like about it what you want to see on the channel um the team of the season champs on the rtg was yeah go and check it out difficult when you haven't got uh such a meta team as most people have at this stage but hey we did okay we did okay i don't claim to be the best um fc 24 player in the world anyway so without any further delay, let's get into the video. I'm going to open the picks first and then the packs. And we are guaranteed a TOTS in this because I do have a TOTS guarantee pack from the objectives to open. So whatever happens, one way or another, we will see a blue today. Okay, six or seven packs in, we get our first walkout in Odegaard. Was also joined by another walkout in that same pick, uh, which was a duplicate, but... They're the first walkouts of sin so far. Oh, and we get a tots. It is only Moose Lera, but it is a 92 rated tots. And with tots being required for SBCs and things, it's always worth um, worth getting. And I don't know about you guys, but the green icons being on the player picks and then not being in the actual pick when you select it is really throwing me off and making me like, double check that I am definitely picking the right cards. I don't like it, EA. Sort it out. Oh, hello, straight away, a 90-11 Golski. We like that as well. Jude Bellingham, another walkout. Definitely will be getting a team of the season, but I think La Liga is much more towards the end. Um, I think maybe even Serie A's before that. Oh, another Moose Lera. Two team of the seasons, it happens to be a duplicate, but hey, it does mean we can sink him into an SBC. I am going to be doing the new icon SBC. Um, I don't think it will be in this. I don't know. It might be at the end of this. If not, it might be in short form content. I don't know, but keep an eye out for it. See what we get. Let me know if you have done that uh, 90 plus icon player pick yourselves and what you've got as we get another walkout in Pedri, because um, I'm intrigued to see. Oberdorf, lovely. Another one that will probably get a team of the season, but we'll also take that for sure. Oh, another one. We've got another goalkeeper as well. Man City goalkeeper Keating. Five foot six for a goalkeeper. Ouch. Oh, I mean, that is, you know, it's nice to have a tots, but that is also on the borderline of a trump guard. Another walkout in Martinez. Would like to see him maybe come to the Premier League. I wonder if he'd do well there. There's certainly some strikers uh, needed in certain teams in the Premier League at the moment. Probably more namely Arsenal, I think. Maybe even Liverpool. Okay, last few player picks and then we've got the 85 pluses. It's a McAllister. We'll take that as well. Another duplicate, but hey, it is going to make that Icon SBC even easier to craft. So we do not complain about that. 
So that is four team of the seasons in the 81 plus player picks. And now we've got three 85s. Are these going to give out as well? Lucy Bronze in the first. Another Jude Bellingham. And then the final one. A Joshua Kimmich. Not great. Really, not great. I mean, they are 84 rated squads with no team of the weeks and things. So, like, you can get 84s and 83s and stuff fairly cheap at the moment. So, in that sense, it's good. But you'd expect better than what I've got there. Uh, I'm just going to pop these into one of the Icon SBCs. And then we'll get into the packs. And I'll show you the best bits. Is that an Icon? Zambora or something? Sam Brotter in a tradable Prime Electrum player's pack. I mean, that must mean that he is so cheap as ridiculous. I mean, sure. Thanks for the 70k. I mean, that's really caught me off guard. A tradable Prime Electrum player's pack. And he's like 80,000 coins. 79. Wow. Okay. And to further myths about those cards, he counted as a bronze. Casemiro, nice. I think a 78 plus times two pack there, so we will take that. Definitely will help the Icon SBC. A Trent Alexander-Arnold in a rare Electrum Players Pack. Again, we like the fodder. Seventy-five plus times five gets us Riyad Mahrez. Just the one walkout, but hey, a seventy-five plus times five, and it's a walkout. We've got to take it. Oh, we've got another Trent, so that means we're gonna have to. Go and do one of the SBCs. I think 86 is a bit low for the icons, so I might stick them into the exchange. Get ourselves another pack. That is a Tonali. Still find it weird that this guy is in the game. I know he's a walkout, so they probably like want to keep him in for fodder and things, because there's other options that will get upgrades and he won't. Um but it's just weird because, yeah, he's obviously banned from playing. Oh, did not expect that. A Parejo in 11 gold players pack. That's from doing the daily logins or the daily upgrades rather. Um, yeah, did not expect that. I skipped it. We've got a team of the season in the... Um, Drea. Oh, okay, I haven't packed this one. Um, this is in the exchange SBC for the 89 rated ones. I've done this at some point. Um, but yeah, I didn't realise I've not got him. Um, might well go as a super sub. I'm planning to do a speed run champs video. Bearing in mind it is now Tuesday. So I would have to do it tonight. Um, yeah, a speed run champs. Shorts format video so it'll be in three parts over shorts um yeah if i can get it done i will yep skipped an irene paredes i knew it because i get her all the time i get her all the time 88 rated is tradable but we need the fodder for the icon SPC. it in a tradable pack. Just a delete. I've never heard the animation of the fishing hook actually sound like he's pulling in a fish. I, I may have just not had it that often or not noticed it, but it took me by surprise. 
Oh, we've got a toxin in 81 plus times two. Is that Allison? Wow. Okay, that's a big fodder player. Or is he fodder? Is my one tradable? No, it's on the tots. RTG is tradable. Oh, okay. Right, I'll go and complete another bit of the SBC then and get Allison in exchange for an icon. Right, okay, down to the final two packs, the 84 plus times seven and the tots guarantee. These packs have been pretty poor. I haven't really got a lot out of them considering like what is available. I know we've got an Allison, I know I've got a Dea, um, but yeah, I just think generally they haven't been that great. 84 plus times seven, is it a pack opening unless you get Luka Modric? He is the only walkout though. And we get a Thiago Silva and Labocca for the duplicates, which means we could just get rid of the 84s. They're not really worth anything at the moment. I've got plenty in the club. So, finishing off with the TOTS Guarantee Pack. Can we get a Premier League player out of this? It says it contains a TOTS, TOTS Moment, Live TOTS, or TOTS Plus player from any of the currently released Team of the Season squads. Come on. Give us a big one. Banza, and that is an absolutely dreadful one. Um, wow. What can we say about that other than the fact that that is awful? So I am going to finish this video with the Icon SBC. Right, team submitted 90 plus Icon player pick coming. Thunderstruck, Winter Wildcard, Team of the Year or Future Stars Icon. I have opened this over on the Tots, S uh, uh, Tots RTG as well. So go and check that out because um, yeah, it made a massive difference to our champs, I think, getting that card. Um, but yeah, you'll see when you go and watch it. Come on, let's see if we can get a massive card in this, please. Oh! I don't think... I don't think anyone's got two Team of the Year I, I, I haven't seen anyone with two Team of the Year icons in a long time. I do like the look of that Beckham card as well. This is a tough choice, no? You guys tell me what you think. I obviously am now going to footbin just to see what it says price-wise. Um, I know I've used one of these cards and I love one of these cards in game. Um, but I'm just going to do price checks anyway. So Philip Lam is only seven, uh, 486k. Right, okay. Javi is 253k. And then Beckham's Future Stars, which I think is actually there now as an SBC anyway. Um, 195k. I mean, so I'll, I will take the best value and the highest rated one in there in Philip Lam. But Xavi, do not underestimate that card. Xavi is a fantastic in-game card. Um, but we'll take that. We've got a Team of the Year icon at the end of the day. That's all you can ask for. They are the best ones in the packs. Uh, Galazos aren't in there at the moment, so we'll take it. I hope you have enjoyed this. A second pack opening for this TOT series, and there'll be another one Friday night when the Bundesliga comes out. As I said, please do subscribe to the channel. It is a massive help uh, to supporting me to try and do more content for you guys. As always, thank you for tuning in. I've been B-Rad. <laughs>